is Stephanie Gray, and today I'm going to show you how to synthesize nanoscale tungsten oxide. Here are the major components of the cation exchange column we'll be using. This is glass wool, this is sand, this is a proton exchange resin, and this is my sodium tungstate, which I will be using to convert into tungsten oxide in this approximately 0.33 molar solution. The tungstate solution is slowly passed through the column and the bright yellow product is collected. Water is added to the bright yellow transparent solution and this is stirred overnight. The tungsten oxide condenses to form a pale yellow suspension. The resulting solution is spun in a centrifuge to drive particles out of the solution. The liquid is disposed of and more water is added to the remaining solid. The solid is sonicated to disperse the particles in water and then the centrifuge is repeated. This washing step removes unwanted ions from the solution. 3% by weight of polyethylene glycol is added to the solution and mixed in. This is dried to yield a powder. Tungsten oxide powder is then placed in a tube furnace at 500 degrees Celsius for two hours. The necessary amount of tungsten oxide is weighed and dispersed into a sulfuric acid solution with a pH of 3.5. The solution of tungsten oxide is ultrasonicated to break apart the solid into nanoscale pieces for about two hours. This results in a solution of tungsten oxide nanoparticles which can be used in a variety of research applications such as irradiation measurements.